big shout, jump up, do the bogle, the limbo, and the calypso spin. Braid your hair, fashion a style, find some flashy costume to put your dancing legs in. It's me, Milo. We're tired, wicked and white. Are you feeling hot, hot, hot? Make I tell you the SP on St. Paul's Carnival. Now let me see, how much time have you got? Carnival started as a church community fete. Sometime, now let me see, can I remember the specific date? Polish Father Bernard started sometime in 68. 80s brought change. The brothers in St. Paul's stood up to oppression. They got serious and tough. Racial riots. Times were hard. They said enough is enough. St. Paul's, a city of refuge. The Rastas stated, I feel we're pleased. After the uprising in St. Paul's, the Rastas from Inkworks gave St. Paul's Carnival an Afro-Caribbean face. The 90s was a high time. Radio One wanted to buy in. A carnival was ready to explode. One million pounds of funding. Tim Westwood, Trevor Nelson, Chris Goldfinger all wanted to buy in on the act. Nelson Mandela was free and Mandela's hideaway was created to mark this historic fact. Police always cooperated, telling the coordinators exactly what they were going to do. Daglo armed response uniforms clustered in a corner, thinking of a spicy chicken stew. Excuse me, some things you might hear at carnival. I've prepared a Yardi translation, which means Jamaican. Yardi man say, Aye, English man say, Oh, rather good what? Yardi man say, Chamanian music I say it tonight. English man say, Oh, golly gosh, this music is such a delight. Yardi man say, My family that. Pop, pop, pop. English man say, Oh, absolutely splendid fellow, super chap. <laughs> Look down Campbell Street. See a carpet of billow pad heads bobbing up and down on the roads. Alongside Agnes Spencer barbecue and jerk chicken in a barrel on a coal fire stove. A large Rastafarian setting up a food stall in his front garden. Gives his carnival coordinator a switch. He said, it's my garden this. I'm not paying carnival for this pitch. Carnival is moving on. Based at sea, it just recently celebrated an anniversary. Pax has bought a new flair, bigger and better possessions. And they're gonna start a carnival academy. Let's celebrate the Afro-Caribbean culture with the whole community and let's have bullet cake with our afternoon tea. So people, hey Paul, whether you're a long man, poor man, rich man, short man, or you just got out on probation, whether you're an artisan, a nurse administering medication, a DJ or an honest politician, whether your sound system's called Toy Boy, Equator, Imperial Force, Lakota, Qualitex, or you're drinking Ribena, Dragon Star, Red Stripe, Lemonade, Mineral water or coffee. Boogie. I said boogie. To the St. Paul's Carnival. Pass it.